Hello, everybody. How are you all doing today? It's Rusty Champagne here with you once again, and I hope you are having a wonderful day. We are here in the wonderful world of kebab chefs. It's been a while since we've been here, and I know that there have been a few people that have been asking when we were going to get back here again, and so here we are. And the last time we were here, we were doing stuff that was part of the Easter update, and that content is still available according to what the devs have said on their Discord. So that is still out there and available to be done. Um, and then they will have it even afterwards. Uh, I think they said that they're going to have it for like regular currency after they officially end the update or after they officially end the event. That's the word I meant, not update. I meant event. So there we are. We've got our fancy Easter egg there. That, that'll probably stick around for a while. We've got our poor waiters that are just kind of standing in here because they don't realize that they can actually leave and go outside. I don't know why they don't know that, but for whatever reason, they don't know that. Uh, now, one of the first things I want to do in this episode is I want to go here and I want to pay my bills. <laughs> so we got to pay the electricity. We got to pay the maintenance. We got to pay the staff. So we're going to do all that. And then after that, we're going to go in here to our gourmets. And we want to invite this gourmet here. And then he will give us an electrical furnace and eight new recipes. So we've already taken care of Juan. But now we're going to make our way to having Tony come by. And he will be here tomorrow. So we will expect him in not too long. Uh, he should be here tomorrow, <laughs> as he said. So we're going to now take a look and let's see what we can do in terms of recipes. Man, it's been so long since I've been here. I'm going to turn off the radio because I don't need the radio. And we are going to take a look. Let's see. What do we want to do for recipes? Because it has been a while since we've done anything here. So let's go. Um, oh, we do like the donor or the dooner or the dunner, however it's pronounced. It's one of those words. So we're going to do this. And I'm also going to do some of this soup. So we're going to try some of this soup out because I've not done this soup ever. And I want to give this a whirl. So we're going to do some soup. I'm going to stick with those two things. We're just going to go with two nice and easy. Just kind of keep it simple as much as we can. So for this, uh, what do we need again? We need some uh, ribeye. So I got to close this up and then get back into it. So then I can pin these. So this is ribeye. And I think after that, we just need some, uh, some fries. Yeah, so ribeye and fries. And that's it. So that's all for that one. And then if we go to this one, this is going to be, oh, this is one that's going to be a little bit more tough. But we're going to try this. We're going to make this happen. We're going to do it. So we're going to add that to a cook pot. And then that's just going to go on the, I think we can just put that on the grill. And that'll be okay. So I believe we're going to be able to do that. We're going to try it. So let's actually get all the stuff. So we need, we need uh, from the store, we are going to need a ribeye and a couple of chicken breasts so we're gonna go oh don't uh, don't hit your door run through it it hasn't been that long since you've been here you still know how to operate a door okay so we need a ribeye and we need a couple of chicken breasts so there's that okay oh it helps if you actually buy it and pay for it and all that stuff just those little things let's take this run it into our fridge again i don't know why i'm having such a trouble with <laughs> opening up my doors I don't quite get it. Let's set that there. And actually, I'm going to just set this in the fridge because I, I re remember that I can pull the stuff out individually because I can just scroll up and down and, and get the stuff that I need. So I'm just going to leave that in there, not worry about taking it out of the box. Now I need, let's see, lemon and potatoes. So let's get a couple of, well, actually, let's just get one lemon. And what else do we need? So just lemon and chicken broth. So I, uh, and then I need potatoes. So we're going to get a lemon, and not from here. That's going to be from over here. I'll get a couple lemons, and I will get a couple of potatoes. So we'll do that. We'll get a couple of lemons. So one, two, and a couple. Actually, it's, uh, let's get three, and we'll get a few potatoes. So one, two, three. Let's do that. So we'll be all good and set for whatever we need. Going to take that box. Going to also throw it in our fridge. I'm going to leave everybody's door open. They're okay with it. They don't have a problem with it as far as I know. Now, our Easter basket should still be there. Yes, it is. Uh, that's what I expected it to be. So we're going to take that. We're going to set that there. I do actually have another lemon there. So that's that. And I have some fries there as well. So I have all that from last time. Now, if I remember right, in one of these drawers, I do have, is this uh, my kindling? Yes, I have all my kindling. 
So we're good there. So now I need some chicken broth. And we're going to see how much chicken broth we need. And I'm going to need a big cook pot as well. And I do not have one of those. So this chicken broth is going to be uh, where? Uh, chicken broth. Can't. So let's get, a, let's get a few of these. Let's get five of those. Let's do that. And then a giant cook pot. Let's do that. And I think we're fine. That should be everything we need. I think we're good. So let's take all that and pay for all that and get that squared away. So now we're going to go in here and we're going to leave our own door open. And now we're going to drop this off and we are going to grab the cook pot. And, nope. We're going to grab the cook pot and take from the box with F and we're going to set that. Now, is that going to go there? That's going to, I think that's going to go there. We're going to find out. Again, no spoilers. We'll find out. Uh, we will do it. And then this is going to go into one of these drawers. So that's where we're going to put our chicken broth. Okay. So now I think we got everything that we need. So let's close this up. Let's get all this going. So from here, we need some water. So we're going to turn this on. Oh, okay. And we need 1.2. And that's pretty close. That's about as good as we're going to get. So, oh, now I got to cut up the chicken. So let's get the chicken. Uh, that's going to be take that from the box and we'll take that from the box again. There we go. And now we just take that and we're going to get it into some slices. Oh, it's been a while since we've done slices. We do love a slice. So there we go. All the slices and we'll put that back in there. So now this is going to go into here. So the chicken, yeah. <laughs> I love the way it floats. <laughs> That's great. I love that. A couple of lemon slices now. So we're going to go here, grab the lemon, set it here, close the door, um, and get some slices. How you doing, sir? How you doing, Timmy? Good to see you. Two slices, and you go in just like that. And then we need some chicken broth. We need 0.15 liters of chicken broth. So let's grab one of these and take it out and close that. Now, how much is in here? 0.15 liters. How about that? It's amazing how that works out. So there's all that. That's everything we need. And then we boil that and transfer it to a soup plate. Okay, so I think this is going to work. We're going to find out. I don't know, but we're going to find out. So let us do this. So we're going to go down here. Nope, not that one. It's here. So let's grab a bag of kindling because we've got plenty. Of no, don't grab the box. Just grab a bag. There you go. It's that simple. You've done this a million times. All right, let's grab some coal. There's very little coal in here. And is that going to be enough to fill that up? Apparently it is. We're going to we're gonna see whether or not we need to put more in. But we're just going to go with this for starters. And all the kindling, we're going to start that up. So now, again, I don't know if this is going to work, but I'm going to try this. So we got everything in there that we need. So we're going to transfer to a soup plate, 0.2, mixture, 0.2 liters of mixture. I wonder, do I need a ladle? I bet you I need a ladle. I wonder if they sell ladles. Because, I mean, how are you supposed to... Uh, do you just, like, pour it out of the pot? Are there ladles here? I would think that they would have them, but maybe they don't. Maybe they do not sell ladles. Maybe you just pour it in straight from the pot. That seems like it's weird. But perhaps that's it. That's not the way I would do it, but hey, who, who am I to tell them how to do their stuff? So I closed my own door. All right, let's try and set this up here. I think this is going to work. We are going to find out. Let's put that on there. Is that going to cook? Uh, I don't know. So I don't know if that's going to get to a boil because I can't set that right on there. So we're just going to we're going to let this do its thing. I'm going to see if this works. I don't see it actually doing anything. So that's what makes me wonder. Because I don't see it like boiling. I wonder, huh. Because it doesn't say anything. Let's go back into the recipe. So I'm going to just keep looking at this. And we're going to see if this does uh, what I think it's going to do. So let's go here. Let's take a look at this menu. If we look at this chicken soup and if we look here, it says, oh, you need a stove. That's why. Okay, so that's not going to work. Uh, that was a good thought. So it helps if I look at that. So let's go to the warehouse and go to stations. And do I have a stove? Uh, no, it's not there. It's uh, there. A stove. So that's what we need. So let's get a simple stove. Did I put one up? Did I put one back there? Yeah, that's not going to work there. Obviously not. I mean, I should have known that. So <laughs> let's, uh, let's move this mixing bowl. And let's buy a stove. Okay, that's what we need. Just a simple stove. So back in here. And we're going to go here. 
to stations and here and buy a simple stove and a single stove and drive it or place it right there, right in between those two things. Perfect. Now, let us escape and close that. And we're going to close this and we're going to turn this on. And that's going. And now we're going to take this and we're going to set it right on there. That makes a lot more sense. And look at it go. So now I need a soup plate. So what's a good soup plate? Uh, you look like a good soup plate. Uh, yeah, soup plate. I think we grabbed it. So, okay, let's set that there. I think that's, yep, that is a soup plate. You are boiling, so now we can take you out. And I guess we pour you in? Uh, yeah, okay, just like that. And point two is, oh, that's a little much. Okay, whoa, oh, no, 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 no. And right click, and we're going to leave you on there. Because I don't think that hurts. No, I think that's fine. So let's take you, put you under the cloche, and that's chicken soup. Hey, cool. How about that? Now, over here, let us uh, open this up, and let us grab our ribeye. Take that from the box, and I'm going to put it right here, and we're going to get you some slices. And that's going to go there, one back into the thing. That's going to sit up there. You are going to go on our Duner machine. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say it differently every time. Every single time. And that won't be annoying at all now, will it? Okay, that's on. And now we need... Oh, we got to get some... Uh, where did I put my oil? It's not there. It's not there. Is it here? No, it's not there. Do I have any more oil? Oh, no, I don't have any more oil. Oh, no. That's not good. Let us run back out. The good news is that the, the meat will be fine on there. So that won't be an issue. So let's get like six. Ah, let's just get ten. Let's get ten. Let's get crazy. Ten of them. And there we go. Put all that in there. He's never seen that much money in a day in his life. So he's like, oh, thank you for buying all the oil. I appreciate it. And let's take all this, put it in one of the drawers. Uh, which of those, that drawer's got stuff in it. How about this drawer? This drawer does not. So let's grab one bottle of sunflower oil. And just give it a zhuzh right there in the fryer. Close that up. Uh, turn that on like that. And we're going to turn that on. So I didn't need, oh, I didn't need the that at all today. So that was kind of a waste. So let's open this, put the fries in there, just like that. Put the basket in there. That's going to go. Let's grab a plate and go with this plate here. And set that there. And now, if I remember right, this was going to take some. Uh, this was uh, some ketchup and some mayonnaise on the plate. Yep, we need the the squirts of those. So a little bit of ketchup and a little bit of mayonnaise. And what a noise! And we're going to take that, put that right there by it. And then we're going to grab our French fries. They are done, boiling hot with our bare hands. Grab the plate, and we're going to set this over here. We're going to go grab our fancy knife, cut off five pieces of this, a one, a two, a three, a four, and a five. Put our knife back, and now grab our pieces, our slices of this, put them on the plate, just like that. Can I do some pivoting? Even in this game, we can have some quality pivots. We've got to have all the pivoting. It is important. It's a little bit slower because these pieces are smaller. And that goes underneath the cloche. And there we go. All right, look at that. We got two nice recipes. Let us get the place open. What day is it? Day 16. The rusty spoon is open for your convenience. So now we got plenty of this, and I think that's fine there. That seems like it's okay there. It's not going to be an issue having that on there, it seems like. So that's good. Nice regulated temperature. So I should go over to this, and I should open this up and grab another potato. And let's get another potato going right now while I'm thinking about it. So let's grab this, get some more slices. And we're just going to slice it up again. And we're going to have it ready just for whenever we're ready to do a little bit more in the way of uh, another Duner plate. Or Dunner. Or whatever it is. It's one of those words. You know what I mean. And we're also going to be on the lookout for Easter eggs. Because they are going to want to drop them off. So we're going to be on the lookout and see if anyone drops off a nice, shiny Easter egg on one of the tables. 
because we can still get more Easter decorations, and we will continue working on that just to see what we can get there. Okay, so we're doing pretty good on both of these. So we're mm. going to have to get some more soup ready. We're up to level 15. Look at us go. Look at it happening. All of it happening. So mm. let's get some more soup ready. So let's get another soup plate and set this out. And let's grab this. We're going to set it right here. And once the soup is mm. gone, okay, we should also get these uh, fries and put them in here. Because we will need those momentarily as well. And we're going to wait and see who comes in next and what they get. So we're going to do that. Are there any Easter Oh, there's an Easter egg. I see it. Let's grab it. Yes. Easter egg in there. So yeah, we can get something with five Easter eggs. So we will do that. And we're going to wait and see. Close that door. And wait and see exactly what it is. Okay, so he's getting the donor. So let's grab this. Or donor. And we're going to put that in there. And then we're going to grab another plate and get this mm. with mayonnaise and ketchup. So some ketchup. And we ran out of mayonnaise. Oh, we're going to have to make sure we get more ketchup and mayo. That's going to be bad. Uh, I should probably put that in a different spot on the plate. So, okay. We need five slices of this. So let's grab some of this. A one, a two, a three, a four... And a five. Put the knife back away. And grab the fries with our bare hands. And put them on the plates. And then grab our five slices of this. One. And two. And three. And four. So much for presentation. And five. Under the cloche we go. And there it is. There you go. You got it. And that's still good. We like it. Now they're grabbing the rest of that. So I can grab this. And we're going to put it in here nice and easy. Oh, that was a little much. Just a little much went in there. I didn't mean to put that much in there. So this goes under the cloche. And perfect. I love that. That's great. So let's take this and kind of set it over here. I'm going to have to make sure I get more ketchup and mayo at some point here. I don't have to worry about it right now, but I'm going to have to definitely make sure I do that. Another Easter egg. So let's grab that and put that right there in our Easter egg collection. And once the day is over, I will have to take a look and see what else we can get with Easter eggs. Because I know we can get some decor, and I know we can actually buy a rabbit. So we could have a rabbit running around outside. That would be fun. So we'll have to take a look and see what we can do. Hopefully, no, we're not going to have that many other people that come in here and get donor or donor or donor. Um, because I'd hate to have to make up more ribeye for that. So we'll see what happens. It would be nice if we had a nice even distribution of people getting... Um, the soup and the dooner. Mm. <laughs> and <laughs> and then we won't have to make anything more. Because at this point, I feel like we've had about 15 customers. Oh, yeah, and the day's over. Or pretty close to over. So I think we're going to be in pretty good shape. We got one more customer, and he wants the soup. And I hope that that should be the end of the day. And another Easter egg has appeared. We love it. And we will take that, put it into our container. So we got seven Easter eggs mm. now. Oh, wow, the restaurant went up to level 16. We went up two levels in a day. That's sweet. And another Easter egg. All the eggs. Going to put that in there. Why is the bathroom open? I didn't open it. Uh, let's close it. I wonder if someone was, like, looking for an actual toilet and couldn't find one. That may be. Uh, the day is over. Let us take this and remove it. And we're going to clean this plate up. I will actually clean this one up myself. I can do that. So let's pick up our own plate and wash it. And we can put away a few plates of our own because we are we are helpful. We do try to help wherever we can. I mean, oh, yeah, that one you uh, <laughs> you were washing as I was washing it. Okay, what else we got? Another bowl. And you can handle the rest of the plates, I think. So there we go. And I will have to buy some more plates, I know. At some point, I'm going to have to worry about that. All right, let's turn that off. So now, let's take a look. I probably need to put this away. So let's close this up. Let's take this. Let's put it in the fridge. And that'll be fine. That'll sit. And now, let us take a look at our warehouse. And if we look at our special, oh, that, oh it's 50 for the bunny itself. So what else can we get? That's just a decoration. 
That's a bunch of uh, that's a bunch of eggs. So do we wait and go for the big one and actually get a rabbit? Maybe that's what we do. I mean, we're not going to get it in this one, but it'd be cool to have the rabbit. So maybe we'll save up for the big one and have that. Uh, and we'll just leave that decor there. At some point, I will have to actually take that Easter egg out of the window. But we're going to celebrate Easter a little bit longer, <laughs> and we'll be fine. Okay, so now I think we can end the day. So let's do that. Uh, end the day. And the donor is up. The chicken soup is up. And if we take a look, we're doing really good. Made a bunch of money and served 15 dishes. Had all the automat earnings. And it is going to be a new day. And again, at some point, I will actually go about the process of updating my, or, or actually doing some decorating to my apartment. I don't know what that day's going to be, but one of these days I'll do that. I just don't know when. So now if we look, we have everything set up for our gourmet. What he's going to ask for, I don't know. I'm not going to worry about making any food because I know that when our gourmet shows up, he's the only person that shows up. Or at least that's what I seem to recall from the last time we did this. So I think I'm just going to have him come in and we will prepare whatever it is that he wants prepared. So we'll see what that is. So let, oh, organize our menu first. Okay. Um, okay. Well, I guess I'll do some more chicken soup and we'll do some more of that. And we'll just stick with this. And I want to see exactly what it is that he's going to order. So, oh, we got to go to the bank. Got to pay the electricity, the maintenance, and the staff wages. We'll do all that. And I've got other things that I can put on the menu. I'm just not going to do it right now because I'm waiting to see what the gourmet is going to order. So we're just going to keep it simple. And we're going to see whether or not he shows up. I, I'm just going to wait. I'm going to see. I must serve a dish to open. Oh, I've actually got to put the dishes out. Okay, that's fine. So let us grab the uh, let's grab the uh, mixture of soup, and let's warm it back up. Is that actually still warm? It looks like it is. I mean, it's weird. It shouldn't be, but according to this, it. Oh, there we go. Now it's hot. I see that there. So let's grab a bowl. Why are you guys standing right in front of that? Uh, you can move to other places. You know that is allowed. Let's grab this and ladle it out. Nope, we'll go this way. And a little more. Oh, is that full now? Oh, it is. Okay, so let's close that. Put it back on there. Put you under the cloche and serve you up. And that's beautiful. And then we're, I guess we'll do some more of the Dooner and uh, get that done. I left that on all night. Oops, that's my bad. Okay, so let's grab another uh, potato out of here and close that up and put you here. And first we're going to get you into wedges. And then we're going to get you into slices. All of it right there. So down here, I think I have... Nope, that's not the chicken broth. You are here. Uh, or you're not the sunflower oil. And where'd that go? Right there. So into the fryer... And we're going to pull the basket out, set the basket right there, grab our fries, throw them in the basket, turn that on, grab that, put that in there. Look at me almost like I know what I'm doing. And we're going to grab the nice round plate. Or do I want to go with the square plate? Let's go with the square plate. Let's do that. Let's get real fancy. And we're going to set this here. I'm going to get this bowl out of the way. i got to find a place to put the bowl. I know I can put it in one of these. Let's just put it there. I don't need that right now. So let's grab this, set this here. Is this ready to go? I believe it is. I think all you got to do is like get it started, and then it's fine. So five pieces of this. One, a two, a three, a four, a five. Got all that. Put the knife away. Going to go over here, grab the plate, put it here. Grab the fries with our bare hands, as always. A little bit of mayo and a little bit of... Uh, well, that was ketchup. This is mayo. You know what I mean. <laughs> order of a, order is not important. And now we're going to grab our meat and put it on there. Uh, three. Look at all the pivots. We do love a pivot. And one more. Okay. There's that. Under that cloche. There it is. Got that all served. Perfect. Now we'll see what happens with the gourmet. So here he is. Today's the day. See you in a few hours. Okay, so other people do show up. All right. 
I couldn't remember that. I didn't remember if that was the way that that actually happened or not. So that is the way that actually happens. That's good to know. So in the meantime, let us get another potato going just in case we need it. Mm. So, no, nope, not a lemon. I didn't really need the lemon. So let's grab the potato and set it here. And everybody's getting the soup. All right, let's get our wedges and our slices. Get that all squared away. Put that in there. Let's throw these back in the fridge. And mm. there. That's all set. And now everybody's showing up for the soup. That's fine. We got plenty of soup. I am good with that. So we can make that happen very, very easily. And we will wait and see if we get any more Easter eggs. And uh, we're just going to kind of stand here and gawk at people. <laughs> Pardon me while I gawk at you from here. I'll be there in a moment. Hope you reserve my table. We absolutely reserved your table. It is there and ready for you. And we will be here when you are here. Mm. So, got everybody all squared away. There's another egg. Perfect. Let's grab that egg and right in there. And you two look like you're having a lovely conversation with each other. I hope you're enjoying your food. And I hope you're loving your service. And thank you for stopping by. There's another egg. How about that? So, we're up to 10 eggs. So another 40 and we could have a bunny. <laughs> oh, you're looking for soup. Okay, so we're going to play this game. Okay, uh, a bowl. And let's set you there. And let's grab the soup off of here. And let's give it a pour. And into, no, we're going to go this way. And oh, a little more. Mm. Oh, that's a lot. That's a lot of soup. I didn't mean to do that much. That's fine. Everyone gets bonus soup today. And soup in there. Okay, well, you don't apparently care if you get too much soup, so that's good. Oh, hey, how you doing? Good to see you. What can we do? Smells fine, but something's missing. Sweet aroma of bakery. Okay, uh, what do you want? I'm Tiny Tony. You can probably guess why they call me that, huh? I whispered to the dough, my friend. I need them with love and talk to Okay, uh, I can teach you this might pass my assessment. Do you like mystery kids? Choose one of the three boxes I will give you and make a meal with the ingredients inside. What can I say? Can you do it? Um, uh, hmm. This one landed on this gentleman's uh, plate, so let's uh, do this. Serve a gourmet dish with given instructions. Okay, let's drop that there. Let's grab these Easter eggs and put them out. We've got Easter eggs everywhere. All the eggs. Okay, there's another egg, and here's another egg. Okay, I probably should be actually working on this gourmet dish instead of grabbing the Easter eggs. So we got a whole chicken, red pepper, green pepper, parsley, onion, lemon. So, okay, let's, uh, can we spin this? I can't. So uh, let's grab everything out of here. So we got uh, this. So what are we doing with all this? I don't know. So we've got, uh, I'm just going to set all this here for now. And we're going to figure it out. Because I'm not sure what we're doing. And we got a lemon. And we've got a uh, whole chicken. So what is this going to be? So do we go here? Uh, do we go to uh, the menu? And do we go to the gourmet? Do I have something? No, this isn't chicken legs. So what is this? Uh, do we have to talk to him? Let's see. Do we talk to him? Maybe that's it. Uh, let's see. Uh, choose one of the three boxes I will give you. and Make a meal with the ingredients inside. What do you say? Can you do it? And okay. So uh, apparently we don't get to figure out what it is. Maybe? I don't know. Let's let's check the gourmet. Let's see what he says. He doesn't say anything. Okay. Let's um let's try and figure this out. If I were to do something like this, what would I do? Well I'd probably take the chicken and cut it up. Okay. Oh, so that's is that chicken legs? Is that what we've got? Let's pick this up. Let's uh, grab it off the floor. We probably don't want his food on the floor. So let's do this. Maybe this is chicken legs. Uh, how do we pick you up? Are you stuck in the floor? There's like one pixel. There's a chicken leg. There's a chicken breast. And we got another chicken. Oh, and a chicken wing. Okay, so there's all that. So, oh, I don't know what we do with you. And I'm guessing we uh, put that all on a... Is that a skewer? Is that what it is? Is that what we're looking at here? Let's go to the menu. Is that one of these new recipes I've got? Let's scroll down. I, okay, unlock. That's an eggplant kebab. No, that's not it. 
So what else? A fried chicken wing. Maybe that's it. Is that what we've got? Maybe a fried chicken wing? Let's keep scrolling. Yeah, let's actually go down. Maybe it's a fried chicken wing. Maybe that's what we got to do. I'm guessing because that's what we got. So let's try a fried chicken wing. So let's go here. And, oh, man, we're going to need all this stuff for this. So let's pin this. And let's, uh, okay, so what do we need? We need breadcrumbs. We need flour. We need eggs. We need salt. We need black pepper. Okay, so let's do all that. Meanwhile, let's take all of this and put it into the fridge. So let's take all this, put it into the fridge. You guys keep him company. I'm going to go out here and get all this stuff. Oh, no. So, yeah, chicken wings. So we need two chicken wings. I don't know if that's what he wants, but we're going to find out. So we need bread clump, breadcrumbs, flour, egg, salt, black pepper. So most of this is going to be over here. So we're going to go over here. Again, I'm just winging this. So we need uh, some breadcrumbs, and we need some flour. And where's the flour? Is it over here? Let's see. Flour. And we need some eggs. And we need some salts. I think I got salt and black pepper. Yeah, I got all that. Okay, so let's take all this. Let's, oh, pay for it. Give him a room. There. And now run this back. And we're going to put all this into a mixing bowl. And we're going to see if this is what he wants. I don't know, but the fact that chicken wings came out of there is what makes me wonder. Is there actually any... <laughs> I wonder if there's uh, stuff that fell into the floor. I don't see it. Maybe I'm going to... I think I need one more chicken wing. So let's try this. Because I don't know what other dish we need here. So let's grab another chicken wing. And we're going to try that. This may be wrong, but we're going we're gonna to go with it. I'm committed now because I don't know what else you want. Uh, you gave me a whole chicken. And I, I'm i sure that there's something else that we're supposed to be doing here. But I'm going to try this anyway because I'm too far in now. So let's grab all this. So we've got uh, breadcrumbs. And we've got some flour. And we've got some uh, three eggs. So we're going to drop this. Oh, yeah, that's right. The eggs all look like that now. So we need one. Nope. Uh, one egg. So drop that in there and another egg and drop that in there and another egg and drop that in there. OK, then we take these, put them on the shelf. That's right. I got all the eggs now. Oh, no, don't fall on the floor. And let's go down there with you. OK, and three things of salt and three things of black pepper. So black pepper, one, two, three. And salt, one, two, three. Okay, that's all there. Mixing bowl. It's going to go here on the mixer. Mix it up. Oh, no, that's not the mixer. That's the mixer. Mix it up. And then that's all going to get all nice and mixed. Close that up. And let's take this, put it back over here. Let us grab our chicken wings. Where did I set our chicken wings? Right there. Probably should not leave that sitting out. So chicken wing goes into there. And we're then going to uh, leave that right on the board. And then we're going to grab this. We're going to set it here. And we're going to take the chicken wing. We're going to put it in. Oh, easy, easy, easy. And we're going to set that right there. And we're going to grab our other chicken wing off of this plate. The chicken wing. Uh, where is the chicken wing? Grab that and put that in there. And we're going to put that on into here. So easy, easy there. Okay, the chicken wings. And then that goes into there. And then we're going to also do some potatoes. And okay, so we're going to put this in here. All right. Again, this is probably wrong. I'm sure it's entirely wrong. I have no doubt that it's entirely wrong. But, but we're going to try it because I haven't made this anyway. So we're going to make this. So meanwhile, we need some uh, potatoes. So I've got that. So we're going to do this. And we're going to set these right here. And then we're going to grill an onion and slice an onion. Okay, so is that almost ready? It's just about there. So let's grab this coal and put this on here. And now this is ready to go. Let's set that there and that. No, I guess I can grab that. Oh, boy. I'm making a mess of this. And, oh, come on. Where's the... Just grab the wing. Just There's a wing in there. There it is. Okay, that's going to go back in there. So now the uh, the uh, those go in there. And the kindling. Where's my kindling? It is in here. 
and we want one of those. So we're going to grab that, put that in there, and start that up. Okay. And then we're just going to take the onion, and we're just going to set it right on. Just like that. And then we now, we just need, yeah, the onion slices and the french fries. And we're going to slice up the onion when it's done. I'll probably throw this in the microwave for just a little bit to heat it back up. Because it'll probably get cold otherwise. So let's see. The fries are done. Going to set those there. And the onion is going. So how's this all doing? Uh, that's all still hot, so maybe it's going to be okay. Again, I'm sure this is wrong. I'm absolutely positively sure this is wrong. But I don't know what else he wants us to do with all this. I mean, I guess I could... I, I should have used all the ingredients that he gave me. I just don't know what he wanted. <laughs> and, and I panicked. I'll admit it, I panicked! And now we're going to take that, throw that on there. Going to serve this up to him. Let's see what you want. How's that? Nope. Yeah, I knew that wasn't right. Uh, what did you want? So, I don't think you're ready to master the art of bakery. Contact me again when you're ready and don't mess it up. Well, again, I didn't know what you wanted. Ugh. I made a mess of that. I definitely made a mess of that. He was not happy. Well, I got free ingredients. So, that's good? Again, I I guess maybe we wanted to, like, uh, yeah. Maybe I just want some lemon and some, I, I, yeah, I don't know. I really don't know. So, until next time, kid, hey! All right, so that ends that day. We, I, it says I defeated him. I don't think that's right. Let's go to the gourmets. Uh... So, yeah, this is weird. Because now this is all open. And it shouldn't be. So I don't know mm. why that's like that. So I don't know if that's a glitch or if we got to, like, restart. And then have him come back again. Maybe that's what it is. I'm not sure. Uh, mysteries abound. <laughs> that's all we know. Oh, and you want some, uh, you want some of the donut, which I don't have ready. Uh, everything's all, it's all askew. Do I even have a potato? I don't even have a potato. So we're, the day's almost over, and I'm mm. not going to worry about making any more of that. That's just going to be fine. Just going to put that plate away, and you two are going to have to leave grumpy. I'm sorry. I don't know what to tell you. We've been completely rattled by the fact that we had a chef that wanted us to make him something with a whole chicken, and I have no idea what it is. Please, no spoilers. <laughs> we will figure it out. We will we will do all kinds of experimentation. We will figure it out. Um, it'll just be a matter of time. Okay, you want chicken soup. I can get a little more chicken soup. I can do that. So let's grab some of that. Let's grab a plate or a bowl and pour some of this in here. So let's grab that. And got a little bit more of this. And we're going to give this a little bit of a drop. Just nice and easy. Uh, oh, there we go. And right, clo right click and put that back. And let you have some soup. And you shall be fine. There it is. And sorry, sir, we're out of meat. <laughs> Nothing I can tell you. I am sorry you're going to have to leave Matt. Uh, we'll, we'll have more for you tomorrow. Actually, we're going to start having kebabs again. Because apparently we're going to have to start making kebabs all over again when all is said and done. So that's going to have to be our next round of stuff, it seems like. So we will wait for this lovely gentleman to finish up his meal. The day is over. I goofed up. I had a whole mess of things and did nothing with it. So <laughs> or I did all the wrong stuff. But, hey, that's the rusty champagne way. Take something that should be absolutely simple and make an absolute mess of it. Because that's just how we roll. Okay, that I think will go away if we just shut that off. I think that, because, yeah, we don't have any way of taking that off of there. That just kind of stays there. And that is fine. So we got all this closed up. We made a gourmet mat at us. It's just another day here at the Rusty, at the Rusty Spoon. Let's close that up. And let's take a look outside at our wonderful Easter egg and just kind of wallow here in our misery of another little bit of a failure. But we will rise again from the ashes and we will make that gourmet happy and maybe just completely winging something because that's how we roll. 
But that is going to be all for this one. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked this video, I'd appreciate it if you gave it a like. If you really liked this video, I'd appreciate it even more if you consider giving the channel a subscribe. Until we meet again, thank you as always for being a part of all my silliness. I am Rusty Champagne, and we will see you later.